It's been an eyesore for more than a decade, but tonight we're learning of plans to breathe new life into the Old Shores Theater in St. Clair Shores. Jermont Terry joins us now with the new development plan. Jermont? The doors to the Shores Theater locked in 2006, but give us some time, people will soon walk back through these doors thanks to one hometown guy's vision. Well, Brian Ford used to say, yeah, get on the right track to nine mile a Mac. The Old Shores Theater is now on track to come back. Yeah, a lot of memories here. After sitting idle for more than a decade, David Harton plans to revive his childhood memories and bring new ones for everyone in town. I've always been able to look at something and see a final product. While you may see a rundown movie theater with dusty seats and a busted screen, David envisions a vibrant future while embracing the past. I think, I think we can make this work. He projects to spend around a half million dollars in renovations. The plans entails taking the two theaters and dividing one side as a restaurant and the other side as an entertainment venue. It'll be for live music acts, um, possibly comedy during the week. Sure, there's a lot of work to get done, but David's convinced this old spot will transform into the happening place it used to be and then some, and it will keep his hometown thriving. It's bringing back something that's been closed for 13 years, bringing it back to life. And again, I grew up here. I see the vision. I know where we can go and what we can do with it. Now, David is hoping that with all of the renovations, they can keep the signature marquee out front, but that's still to be determined. One thing we know, it's going to take at least 18 months to two years to get all these plants up and running. But when it's all said and done, it will truly transform and change Nine Mile and Mac. Reporting live in St. Clair Shores, Jermont Terry, Local 4.